Hey everybody, this is Stratagem, and today we're gonna watch My Little Pony Friendship is Magic Season 7 Episode 21, Marks and Recreation. With a title like that, I'm guessing this will be about cutie marks in some way, so probably a CMC episode. Maybe we'll get to see the cutie mark camp, which was briefly mentioned in Fame and Misfortune. Anyway, CMC episode. It's been a while since we had one of those. Last one was The Fall in Our Cutie Marks back in Season 6, so I'm curious to see what'll happen here. Maybe Gilda or Babs might make a return. After all, they are considered to be crusaders as well. Guess we're gonna find out right about now. And here we are, painting. Okay, let's see how your still life's coming along, Kittlecorn. That is well, that certainly a circle. Is round? I can make it rounder. I I'm that's all don't think that's gonna be your talent. We'll circle painting and on the way to figuring out what you're meant to do you'll find a ton more stuff you like that's what makes looking for your cutie marks so great mm -hmm. so yeah apparently this is a cmc episode and it's about drawing circles Sorry, if you're oh pipsqueak shop. We'll to help you tomorrow. and some new designs there i don't know if we can help them tomorrow working with blank blanks one at a time takes forever if only there was a way we could help a whole herd of them at once. That would be perfect. We'd save time and we could help each other. That's just like probably to. not going oh, to work. Have to be somewhere big enough to handle all those blank blanks. Somewhere outside with tons of activities to try. Are you two thinking what I'm thinking? Cutie Mark Day Camp! Okay, that's going to be to the camp. Okay. Camp Friendship! Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, so they are going to camp friendship, okay. That's the camp where AJ and uh, Kalaratura met, if I remember correctly, and of course I do. Affiliates. Oh, we have Rumble. Oh, hey, Crusaders. Look, I can't stop. Gotta meet my brother for something. Is that the same voice he had back in, um, what's it called? Hurricane Flutter Show? Okay. What you got there, little brother? What? I think they both have different voices. Ooh, let's look at the trash. That's interesting. And Thunderlay found a way to get rid of his annoying brother, I guess. Who's excited to be here? No pony! Oh well, they seem excited. Well, we're excited too! At Kitty Mark Day Camp, you'll be able to try all kinds of things. Kayaking! Horseshoe tossing! Circle painting! <laughs> you can try them all! But the most She's really into her circles, I guess. Then I bet it'll work for these little guys too. I thought you said we were gonna go practice for the Wonderbolt's Ponyville Extravaganza show. I'm going to Wonderbolt practice. You're going to Cutie Mark practice. <laughs> Since when is a Thunderlane a full fledged Wonderbolt member? Rainbow Dash is practically my sister, and she's a Wonderbolt too. I know she'll be mad if I'm late. Does Pip speak now, quick have, uh, have another voice again? Who knows what you'll be good at? Kinda sounds different. Alright! Looks like we found the first activity of the day! The horseshoe toss! Rumble looks ecstatic. Well, I stay and play, but it's time to fly. Have fun! And a bit of showing off. Of course. Come on, Rumble! Step on up and show us how it's done! No way he's as good as his brother! And there we got the conflict of Oops. the episode. Oh, I guess. I guess I won't be getting my cutie mark in the horseshoe toss. <laughs> oh, you Don't sound... Worry about it, Rumble. <laughs> sound not at all uh, sarcastic. I wasn't worried. Good, because there's a ton of other stuff to try. 
We'll find you something you're good at. <laughs> He's thrilled, I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> Archery with hoofs. That's probably not very easy as well. Whoops. <laughs> He's totally into it. What's that? Write your own name. Lines have five syllables, but the middle has seven. It's called a haiku. Nobody likes haikus. Though I do like that guy's hair. Whoops. I've tried it all. Time to tell my brother this camp isn't for me. Come on, Rumble. Isn't it fun just trying stuff? Yeah, he's totally Rumble. having fun. Skedaddle. That's, That's a weird name. Working together and helping each other. Yeah! So no circle painting cutie mark for you. But I can still come back, right? And maybe paint some circles? <laughs> of course. Let's all meet right back here tomorrow. Hooray! Well, everyone's excited. I can't believe we got a cutie mark Except for Rumble. Day. Yep, this camp was a pretty swell idea. Every pony's really enjoyed it. <sighs> Every pony except Rumble. You didn't have much luck with anything. Trying to find out what you're meant to do can be frustrating. You remember how long it took us to get our cutie Yes, mark? five seasons. <laughs> I remember the nightmares. Well, we can't let Rumble quit camp just because he didn't find something he's good at yet. We'll just have to convince him to come back and try harder. Mm. Yeah, I think the problem is that he doesn't give a rat's ass. you all doing here we just wanted to apologize for not finding anything you like today oh whatever it's fine it's not fun it's frustrating and we know what it's like i'm not frustrated yeah it's you are okay. we've all been there but we won't give up on helping you we know you'll get your cutie mark every pony does actually i don't need your help because i don't want to get my cutie mark what? oh well he is the uh, anti-cmc Cutie mark. He said it again. Quick, get an exorcist. Not wanting a cutie mark is like not wanting to breathe. Yes, I know that feeling. Every thing. pony wants to know what they're meant to do. Hm, not this pony. Why? Because cutie marks are silly, and and they just force you into one thing your whole life. Oh wow. That's silly. Having a cutie mark doesn't mean you can't do other things. That's yeah. kind of sort of uh, marks on help and ponies with meta their cutie marks, but commentary. I still Making potions with Zakora. And when was the last time you did that? Um, I, I think it was last uh, Tuesday. Well, we've been pretty busy helping other ponies lately. Oh, you mean doing the thing you got your cutie mark for? The thing you're stuck doing for the rest of your life? Okay, maybe we will. Yeah, that be is doing that kind of a criticism that. Well, that's fine for you. Criticism that uh, gonna be put in a box. people in real life have as well with the, the concept of cutie marks. It's gotta be the strangest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, for you. Only says some ponies have to find their own hay. Are you sure she didn't mean find their own way? Oh, that would make more Here's sense. I can't believe Rumble isn't interested in getting his cutie mark either, but we can't force him. Oh, we can. We've got a whole camp full of ponies who are interested in cutie marks. Mm-hmm. Here he comes. The fastest. Pulls the lead flyer in Equestria. Motherland! <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say me. You're not the only Pegasus in the family, you know. Yeah, probably not. Oh, sorry, little brother. You're right. You might be the most elite flyer in Equestria someday, but for now, you should try other things too. Speaking of which, aren't you supposed to be at camp? I 
camp is for losers who can't do anything. Great. So there's no pressure. <laughs> you can try everything and not be worried about looking bad. I'm not worried Amazing about that. Logic left I just don't want to get a cutie mark in any of their ridiculous activities. Well, you're still going back tomorrow. You can't be a blank flank forever. Ah. Oh, you're getting bad ideas, my friend. Alrighty, cutie mark Maybe campers. ask That's Starlight about that. But this is fun, and I didn't get my cutie mark yet. What if I'm not good at anything else? You don't get a cutie mark just because you're good at something, or even because you like it. There's more to it than that. I'm real good at painting <laughs> Cutie mark in haikus, which is what I like, but uh, I'm still a blank flank like you. So you get your cutie you mark in get a cutie mark in something uh, you like. Drawing now circles, maybe. You don't have to. Ta da! Rubble, you came back! And he's going to stir up trouble. Say goodbye to painting circles. You'll be too busy haikuing from now on. But I like circles. <laughs> what on, the hell rubble? is wrong That's with her? So that's how cutie marks work? Am I speaking old ponies? Probably. I just said it wasn't. Cutie marks are great, they say. Yeah, right. They make you special in your way. But that special mark that's just for you will erase the stuff you like to do. So, no more painting? Do we actually get a song, a song for a background character? That's not how bow and arrow works. Wow, that's the first time a background pony gets a song. That's kind of funny. With blackjack and hookers? Talk I'd expect to hear from Camp Cutie Mark, which is why blank flanks need a camp where we can enjoy being blank flanks and appreciate our blank flankiness without feeling flankiness. <laughs> okay, is that a word? Now hold on, every pony. Blank flanks forever. Blank flanks forever. Blank flanks. Oh, she even painted over her cutie mark. <laughs> wow. No. I just can't see what we did wrong. Everything. I every pony was having fun. They were until that rumble came and made a mess of things. What are they doing now? It looks like whatever they want. Scandalous. 
Oh, she's back to drawing circles. <laughs> Honestly, it's not all that different from what they were doing here. Then, what was the point? Point is that Rumble is a mad pony who must be stopped. Now calm down, Crusaders. <laughs> we just need to talk to him again. The key is to remain calm. Cutie marks! <laughs> Someone is being very calm. Special little box. Special box. Come on, sweetie Bill. I think you remain calm long enough. <laughs> Kettle corn, you covered your cutie mark. I'm blank flank again, keeping my options open. I'm more than haikus. You just haiku right then. That's don't let them get in your head. Kinda sort of. What CMC said back in uh, their first episode. Wasn't it uh, everyone was jelly of them because they still had potential and all that jazz? Wow, you're cracking great! Thanks! Oh no, what if I get a cutie mark in it? Then you'll be stuck doing it forever! Blank Flanks, no more potential cutie mark activities! You already have one. Yeah, you can continue well, painting so day camp is a bust. No, it isn't. It's a swell idea. We just can't seem to talk any sense into that that rumble. Oh look, that's the Wonder Balls. Starlight? <laughs> Let me get this straight. My little brother upended your entire camp? How in Equestria did he do that? Well, it started when he couldn't toss a horseshoe or paddle a kayak or shoot an arrow or use a pencil and he felt bad that he wasn't good at anything, but now he doesn't want a cutie mark at all because he's afraid he got stuck doing something he doesn't like forever, you know? <gasps> no, I don't. <laughs> Rumble's good at all that stuff. Well, that doesn't make a lick of sense. Unless he was being bad at stuff on purpose. Yeah. I said he wasn't was of giving a rat's ass. Ever since I became a Wonderbolt, Rumble's either watching me or trying to fly like me. He won't do anything else. That's why I thought your camp was such a good idea. I don't understand. If Rumble wants to be a Wonderbolt someday, what's wrong with that? Not a thing. But right now, he isn't even giving anything else a chance. Sounds to me like Rumble isn't afraid of being put in a box at all. It doesn't? Nope. I think Rumble's already picked out a box. He's afraid he'll get a cutie mark that'll keep him from it. <laughs> well, you guys are having fun. I say this, Rumble, but Blank Flank Forever Camp is kind of boring. If we want to save Blank Flanks, we can't risk doing stuff. What if I get a cutie mark and being bored? Attention, Blank Flanks! That would be a great cutie mark. I want one. I want the cutie mark and being bored. The cutie mark crusaders are pleased to announce today's special guest, Thunderlane! Hey everybody, it's me! It's me, I have lines now! Unicorn, you can't become a Wonderbolt anyway. Oh, oh good, the only Pegasus is now finally joining the other team. So the only one who has any chance of actually doing something Wonder Boat related. Alright campers, it's time for our last activity of the day. A Wonder Bolt obstacle course. Just like the one they'll fly through in their upcoming show. But on the ground, since not every pony has wings. Yeah! Not everyone who has wings can fly, right Scoots? Just say them.
Wonderling? Aren't you gonna run the course? Nope. I know I'm a Wonderbolt, and my cutie mark is all about moving fast, but I really like to cook. Since when? Well, we take turns making the meals at Wonderbolt HQ. I didn't want to at first, but now I love it. I just wish I tried it sooner. You do? Of course. There's more to me than just flying. And I bet there's more to you, too. Time to get food poisoning. Obstacles are fun. Running free through mud and dirt beats circle painting. Then Haku pretty well sums it up. <laughs> Looks like Thunderlane was right about the obstacle course getting Rumble to come back over. Hey, Rumble, aren't you gonna do our Wonderbolt course? I'm cooking today. Maybe I'll do the course tomorrow. So you're coming back tomorrow? You're not worried about getting your cutie mark? You'll get a cutie yeah, mark in cooking. I already know I'm a good flyer. <laughs> it kind of runs in the family. I guess it's time to see what other stuff I can do. <laughs> so yeah, that was that. Yeah, again, interesting that we got a song uh, sung by a background character. That's that's a first, I guess. I think I. Am I wrong? I don't think I'm wrong. I think that I think that was a first. And yeah, that, w that was a pretty fun episode. We had an interesting uh, take on the cutie marks. Ever since uh, the season three finale, people have been uh, more critical of the of the entire concept of cutie marks. What with them being linked to a destiny and not just a talent. So it's interesting for them to actually tackle that issue that just because they have that certain talent destiny thingy that it's not necessarily what they'll be doing all the freaking time in their life. Which is kind of something that that we already saw with the main six, if, uh, if we're being honest here. Uh, Rarity has a cutie mark in uh, gem finding. A cutie mark is not about fashion or stuff. She got a cutie mark for finding rare gems. That's her special talent, her special unicorn magic. Which Twilight can, afford, can of course replicate because Twilight. <laughs> but yeah, despite her cutie mark kind of being, kind of telling her to become a professional miner or whatever, she did become a fashionista, despite that not being her talent. Uh, Rainbow Dash's talent is going fast, and for well, the longest part in her life, she was not a Wonderbolt, but member of the Weather Patrol. So uh, that's not about going fast, that's about making weather. I think there are a lot of Pegasi working in the weather department who aren't uh, necessarily gifted in the art of uh, punching clouds, <laughs> whatever. Yeah, same goes for Twilight. Twilight is uh, now the princess of friendship despite being the element of magic and being talented in magic. Pinky is talented in parties, yet her job is baking pastries uh, at Sugar Cube Corner, so... Uh, so yeah, it's uh, not necessarily that you'll be doing uh, what your cutie mark is telling you all the time. Or not even make it your job. Okay, let's see. Ah uh, yes, Rumble did have a different voice actor this time and it is Vincent Tong. I think I know that name. Yes, I think I do. <laughs> That's uh, Flash Sentry, also known as the Orange Pegasus, also known as the Waifu Stealer. Yeah, so he was Rumble this time. Okay, and I think the other ones, uh, Thunderlane, I don't know who spoke him earlier, but I think that's a different voice actor and Pipsqueak, I'm not sure. Anyway, that was a that was a pretty fun episode, I liked it. Glad to see that we got a new song again, even if it was a bit different from what we usually get in the show. But yeah, not too bad, not too bad. I enjoyed the episode, and yeah. So let's see what'll happen next week, or rather, wait a second. Let's see next episode it would be... Yeah, uh, before the next episode there will be the My Little Pony movie. Um, I'll be watching the movie in cinema, so I will not be doing a reaction to it, because really I I do not intend to, uh, to wait until it's released on DVD or something like that. I'm gonna watch it in the cinema, so no reaction from me to that. So, movie next time, and the next video will be on episode 22 then, Once Upon a Zeppelin, which uh, I have no idea what the hell that is going to be about. But um, yeah, good episode, excited for the next one, excited for the movie. As always, I've been Stratagem, thanks for watching and see you on the next episode.